Bruce White, Lucas Wolf on the front row. 20 laps the distance as they work through turns three and four. Coming to the white line, green is out. Your world challenge off turn four. Trouble on the front straightaway. Cody Dara, Sammy Swindell involved. Dara is upside down. Sammy Swindell on the right rear wheel and Craig Delansky involved as well. Taking a look as they work off at turn four. Green is out, here we go. 20 laps the distance. Down the front stretch, into turn one. Lucas Wolf on the high side, grabs the early lead. Jason Sides coming after Bruce White, the battle for second side by side toward turn three. Shane Stewart clipped off three now, four spots already back in the pack as he works to the high side of turn four. Almost gets into Allard as they work into the high side of turn four. It is Lucas Wolf leading and Jason Sides in second. Stewart now gaining ground on Jeffrey down the back stretch. Jeffrey goes to the bottom, as does Stewart, but Jeffrey cannot hold the low side of the speedway. Opens up the inside lane for Shane Stewart, who puts the front wheel on the berm and still makes the pass into turn one. Shane Stewart will stay on the bottom side of the racetrack as they work through one and two. Here comes Linton right back through the middle. Linton and Jeffrey looking to the outside, but not near enough. As we go cross flags this time, halfway home, 10 down, 10 to go. 10 laps in the books, and the lead for Lucas Wolf, an astounding 4.2 seconds. This time by will be here it comes. Shane Stewart. Stewart gets by Jason Sides. Stewart takes over the second spot as the white flag flies for Lucas Wolf. On his way to his first victory here at the Knoxville Raceway. Checkered flag will wave off turn fourth. Your winner, the Conner 5W, Lucas Wolf. Yeah, obviously I was fortunate to have a uh, good opportunity to start in the front row and was able to uh, have clean track the whole time. I caught uh, caught a lab, couple lap cars that were uh, kind of running through the middle and they were easier to get and I kind of caught up to Jonathan there and I thought uh, thought it'd be best try to save the tires as much as you could. Obviously worried about running the top uh, hard on left rears that whole time so we were able to uh, kind of just get in there and ride behind him. I didn't want to didn't want to have to pass him if I didn't have to necessarily, but we were slowly catching up on him. I got a little bit tight when I got closer to him, but was able to uh, hang on enough and uh, get a win. So obviously extremely happy to be able to stand up here. Any race at Knoxville is definitely important, and uh, I love coming out here. It's uh, I'm, I'm happy that uh, I'm always happy to come out here. These guys work really hard on it. It's uh, it's a place that we deserve to be at and uh, belong at. Hopefully more. I'd love to uh, love to have about 10 outlaw races here a year, but uh, this is where uh, guys are made. So hopefully this is the first of many trips for me up here.